Retaining that medieval atmosphere, we called in on a stately home, parts of which date back to those bow and arrow days. Bewley, Lord Montague's beautiful estate in Hampshire. Here we burst with a bang into modern times, or nearly modern times. We're entering the miracle age of motor cars. By Genevieve we are. On the lawns before Palace House, an auction of veteran cars is taking place. And one lucky old crock fancier is going to become the proud owner of a Hampton Drophead built 33 years ago at the knockdown price of £62.10. shillings. It's on this very spot that they hold the famous jazz festival. And we're wondering what it would be like to rock and roll in this Humberette built 10 years before the First World War. Gather round and see if there's a bargain to be picked up and kept nicely polished for next year's London to Brighton Veterans Rally. You'll never know. She is a really genuine brass radiator tea, and there are less than a hundred serviceable teas known to exist in England. Well, coming through now is a real glorious showpiece. A 1912 Hispano Suiza type Alfonso 13 sports car. Will you bid me 1300 for it? At 1300 pounds, will anybody bid me? At 1300, I'm now bid. At 1300 pounds and the bid's there, will anybody bid me 1350 for it? At 1350, if you like, I'm selling it then at 1300, gentlemen, for the first. At 1300 for the second. At 1300 for the third. And the last time, sold at 1300. Thank you very much. As you've heard, a Hispano Suiza, one of the world's first true sports cars built in 1912 and bought now by the Montague Motor Museum. A lot of money to pay. But here's a racing Riley 12, a rare masterpiece in motor oils, they claim. That one changed hands for a mere song.